for our Sunday dinner today, I've got, as you can see, lots of oh, banana squash, zucchinis, bananas, uh, crook neck. So I'm going to take these zucchinis and make, for the family today, I'm going to make um, lasagna, zucchini lasagna. So, let's show you how to do that. Okay, so cook up this uh, turkey burger and put a little bit of water in it because it doesn't have any fat in it. And let's season it with some garlic salt. Garlic salt in there. And chop it up. All right. Now take this zucchini. Cut the ends off. Put those to the rabbit. I'm going to slice this up. Now those are kind of long. I'm going to cut it in half. This is a long zucchini. Let's see. Okay, and that's slicing them for me. A little bit wider slices. Let's see how that's doing. We've got our slices here. Now let's do the other half. Got these little grabber things in it. Okay. Get with oil. Now the rest of these, I they need to something has to be done with them, but I don't want to bake anymore today, so I'm just going to shred them all and mark the bags and freeze them, and I can use them for later for banana, I mean zucchini bread or some other dish. So I'm just going to shred all those. Getting ready to head to Oregon, so I had to put the crook neck squash, the butternut squash, and the zucchinis shredded and in bags. Squeeze, uh, squeeze the air out and peaches with skins on ready to go and we want the zucchini to dry out a little bit so I'm just going to lay them on this paper towel and put some salt on there okay and I cut up some a package of mushrooms and I already had some peppers that I had cut out, yellow and red peppers. So I'll use those. A couple of those. Alrighty, let's dice an onion. Okay, got the onions, peppers, and mushroomies. Alright, the hamburger is cooked. And I'm going to freeze these containers because you only need one pound and I had three pounds so I'm putting these in containers to freeze okay I'm gonna cook the onions in here saute them in here let's get them going let's put those in there I'm gonna cook them and just kind of about five minutes. All right, those have sauteed for five minutes. Smelling good. All right, let's do the mushrooms. Okay, that'll be nice. Okay, for tomato paste, I'm going to use my dried tomatoes. That's one tray. Here's two trays. Alrighty, we'll let that soak in. Turn it off. Add a little bit of water. I will use a little bit of this. This is what I, oh, the dried tomatoes, but I just have that around to dry them yet, so same thing. Let's let that soak in and that'll be our tomato paste. Oh, that's why it opened up. 
All right, that looks good. So, put in two tablespoons of brown sugar, one tablespoon of salt, I mean one teaspoon, well, a handful, and a teaspoon of oregano. Finish that off. And stir it in. Let that saute for a bit. All right, now let's put the sauce in. In the pan here. Half of it. If there's any left over, I can freeze it and save it. Okay, now let's do the zucchinis. Zucchinis on there. aluminum foil over it first. Bake for 45 minutes at 325 degrees. Alright, the timer went off, so take the aluminum off. Cook it another 15 minutes. Uh-huh. Okay, here's the zucchini lasagna. Lasagna, we'll see if you like it or not. And we'll see if you guys like it or not. Lasagna, Amanda said it tastes alright.